The ROG Xbox Ally just launched and we want to put as many of our games on it as possible. I'm going to show you how to access Steam, the Epic Game Store, and Battle.net, so you can play everything on the one device. Of course, this will work on both the Xbox Ally and Xbox Ally X, since they have the same Windows 11 operating system. And while it's easiest to do this with a mouse and keyboard plugged in, you can of course navigate all these steps with the controls or touchscreen. Let's start with Steam, and surprise, Steam is actually already installed on your device. Simply open search and type it in, and it's all ready to be launched. If for some reason you don't have Steam on your device, maybe you accidentally deleted it, simply open up the Microsoft Edge browser and search for it, and install it from their website. You actually can't install it from the Microsoft Store app, which is curious. Sign into your account. Now you can buy games and see your Steam library. Select a game to install. You'll even find a shortcut for it on your desktop. To make things easier, press the library button on your ally. This launches the Xbox Store's library. Navigate to just installed games and you'll see all your installed games from any storefront there. Now let's talk about getting another PC storefront on your ally. The Epic Game Store is a great storefront to put on your device since it has a lot of games exclusive that you won't find on Steam, like Fortnite. They also give out free games every week and offer a ton of discounts for returning customers. This one is not pre-installed, so open the search app from your desktop and type in Epic Game Store. Do your search and go to their website. Select download in the corner. Once it's downloaded, open the install file and begin to install the software. After that, open the Epic Game Store and log into your account. Now that you have the store, you can purchase games or immediately download something from your library. You can even choose to put a shortcut on your desktop if you want a quick way to launch the game. And there you go. Now the game runs, and if it supports cloud saves, then you'll be able to pick up your progress from whatever platform you are playing the game on. Just like before, if you press the library button on your ally, you can now see your Epic Game Store games in your installed section. Last, let's install Battle.net so you can get access to Blizzard's games such as World of Warcraft, Overwatch, and Diablo. Open search and type in the name, select Battle.net under the store category to launch the Microsoft Store and hit install. I would recommend unselecting launch Battle.net when you start your computer unless you want that to load every time you boot up your ally. Continue with the install. Once you log in, you'll find the launcher on your desktop, or you can search for it. And of course, you can find your Battle.net games in your games library too. That's all you need to know about getting Steam, the Epic Game Store, and Battle.net running on your Xbox Ally handheld. They'll all be located in your games library and even have icons depicting which storefront they're installed through. You can check out my full review of the Xbox Ally now, and let me know in the comments if there's more you want to know. Thanks so much for watching.